Yeah, I don't remember Alex Kinley ripping any cards yet. Yeah, that's right. I just thought I'd check on the off chance. Alex, play played with tarot that. cards? Mm -hmm. Have you played with tarot cards in the game? Mm -hmm. Cool. That's mm -hmm. big no. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Everybody gives their cards to Pete because he is. Yeah, so and... Matt, I'm not sure if Matt was aware that Alex could get grab his tarot cards and start playing with them. Uh, Pete said you can grab your tarot cards and start playing with them at some point if you want. Okay. If he doesn't want to, I'm quite happy to rip them up, but I thought he'd assume he didn't <laughs> want to play with them. He says he's happy to rip them up if you don't want to play with them. He said, ma. Yes. <laughs> Okay, Doc got Doc's cards. So it's early morning. It's like an hour before dawn type thing. I'm giving you guys the maximum amount of time. You got a good night's sleep. Uh, you've eaten an early fucking breakfast. You have some time to go travel around and do all of your shit. You're card ripping. You're mm -hmm. taking one head, trying to find their head, stealing that. I have no idea how you're going to find their head since you don't have access to the bunker anymore, but... Well, I was gonna. I was looking to see if uh, I could use the head to find, see if there was a way to see if, where other. It heads really doesn't. It really doesn't have those kind of controls on it. It's kind of like just go and do shit type thing. Yeah, then I'll just fly that head. Uh, that'll save you time. But which zone are you wanting to go to to uh, rip your cards before you go to the head zone to get the head to shadow walk to the air zone? I suppose the thing is that. Because it's going to be hard to use the cards in Land of the Lost, you might as well just see what they do and not worry about buffing yourself for the 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 thing, unless you want to risk. Well, I was going to say uh, if he rips them in a different zone, like in a in a zone that has high magic in it, then if he goes to Land of the Lost, then each effect that he gives a shit about, he has to roll the Willfire times three. Yeah. But if we go and get the Zardos set and travel in that to land a lost, unless it travel, unless it flies really fast, it may, I don't know how fast it flies actually, whether or not we'd get there in less than a day or not. Yeah, yeah. Shadow, or no, shadow walking, it will take a few days. Yeah, good point. No, it depends on or, how fast oh, it flies. Oh, no. Flies. Sorry, yeah, good point. Um, you could probably get there before sundown. You'd have, you'd have an hour or two to launch your attack, but if okay. you take longer than that, then. Yep, yep. All right. Before we leave the embassy for our journey, did we want to take anything out of the out of storage that is currently there, like the grenades or? Yeah, I was gonna say we should all grab some of the grenades. All right. I have one already. He pulls it out of his pack like it's nothing, and everybody goes. Oh, I know how to use them. And he gets like, excuse how us. Many, They've seen how many grenades off. do we want to take? Just so I can mark it down that they're gone. How many are left? Fourteen. Three each? Yep, all right. Yep. Oh, do either of you want to use this? Oh, you know what? I should hold on. Well, yeah, do you guys use swords? I do. Do you, do you have a good sword? I have a dwarven sword. This is a good sword. It's uh, it hits hard, like harder than a regular sword. But its thing is though, is that it, it armor means nothing to the sword. You're not and sure if you, that's magic, by the way. Magic effect or no? Uh, and if you parry with it, you'll damage whatever weapon you're parrying against. That's a pretty good sword. However. There is an evil entity living with it, within it, and it might try to take over your mind, get you to become a mass murderer and such. Hmm. <laughs> I forgot to have Chris roll the willpower on that before. Shit. How how strong is the evil entity in there? I'm not oh, sure. Do you want me to roll my willpower on that right now? Sure, that'll give you an idea. What's your willpower times five normally so I can figure out the... 100. Uh, right, roll something low and impress Logan. It's pretty tough, but you were tougher. <laughs> Not that tough. <laughs> Not that tough. Um, right, let me see. Let me look it up now. 
Let's see. So, oh, wait a minute. All right, you're already evil. Um, <laughs> hmm. um, yeah. I, with that role, you've decided, you know, fuck the lightsaber. This is your new weapon. It has become your choice weapon. And you can tell that it's it's getting its tendrils into you slowly. I have a reroll if you want. Yeah, I was going to say I've got a supporter reroll. Oh, there you go. Oh, you yeah, if you could play it since you have more cards than us. Yeah. All right. Hang on a second. <laughs> Jesus. All right. So I was thinking, at the moment, at, out of the five cards I have, I have three rerolls and two supporter rerolls. <laughs> I'd ditch one of the re-rolls myself. Yes, but. yes, I was going, um, do, do either of you want to re-roll before I throw it? No, no I haven't. This See, I don't know, I have a skill 15, which could be used yeah, yeah, for yeah. shadow walking. Mm -hmm. But the yes. crafting 20, I'll ditch the crafting 20, because I don't think we need to make any. Yeah, yeah, all right, I'll give you the re I'll, I'll play the re-roll for you then. And then I'll well, actually, no, I'll trade you the re-roll, and I'll play the supporter re-roll on you. There you oh, go. okay. That way, you've got to re you still got to re-roll, and then it'll reduce my hand down by one, so I can hopefully like hold plan. whatever card I get next. This is a party in grave need of the yin yang card. There we go. Time straight, Logan. That, You're like, that, take a check in willpower. Yes. Um, no problem. You resist the evil of the sword. It's definitely a, it's a strong evil. It's an evil evil. It wants you to ditch your lightsaber. All kinds of crazy shit. Yeah, it, it's really it, it. It'll try to take over your mind and make you do things. If you decide to leave it somewhere, it is awkward to carry a whole extra sword with you. Uh, mm -hmm. Then please make a note of where it's getting left. Personally, I think it should get destroyed because I don't think people will be able to resist it for very long. Did you but... want to go via Burlington? <laughs> <laughs> it's better than going looking for a fucking volcano with a bunch of hobbits and shit around. Mm -hmm. Or what I could do is I could try to uh, hold on. Keep in mind you're in a no magic zone, kind of, or very fucking Pardon. difficult magic zone. Hold on one second. I do like I do like Pete's casual. Whoa! Well, stop by Burlington. So going into the sun or whatever. If, oh, if, if any of you have something that's kind of important to you, we could always try to uh, ghost fetter the the intelligence inside to a different object, and then the sword is still intact. For the ghost fetter, you'd need to be a ghost to cast that. You never that you've let me do it in the past, though. Uh, maybe at a severe negative, but it's on the ghost tree, which all the ghost tree shit is, you're a ghost. Uh, Matt Matt was able to do some of that because he could turn into a ghost for a short time. Not sure okay. if he can anymore, though. Oh, no. Now he can't, now he says. He's uh, my AI white power. Ah. But I still retain the skill at his level. Yes. So someday when you die, you will be the bestest ghost ever. <laughs> And honestly, we should just probably destroy the sword. The evil sword? I, I think and so. It, it's pretty... Unless, un, unless we can purge the sentience from it, yeah. The sentience might even be what gives it its power, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that was my... That's yeah, it, it could be, too. Do. Yeah. So, stop by Burlington and go... Beep, beep, beep. <laughs> The problem is getting into the police station, because before when you've used the box thing, it's because everybody was dead. You're, no, we know so. that they all go and look up. They 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 leave the police station to guard the vault during the day, and the cop also leaves, and they leave the door open, unlocked it because it's Burlington. So we just wait for him to leave, and then we go in. Right. So it'll it'll chew up some time in Burlington because they don't do it when it's still dark out. Do you want to go to Burlington? No. Or? Well, that's fine. We can I think it's Clems during the daytime anyway because Clems is shut at night normally, unless that's changed. I uh, know. Good point. So you guys have to wait around till dawn anyway. Um, climbs. And I suppose the question is, do we want to borrow the phone from Burlington and take it with us and see whether or not we can have fun and hijinks with it in Land of the Lost? I think that's a good idea. I like that. Yes. Yep. As a backup, as a additional fun and hijinks. Um, let's see. Everybody give me a... 
uh, what's it called? Joe? No, no, not that. Uh, evidence analysis at half quarter is better. Great. Fucking home. Right. And Bye, Sherlock. Uh, and Fulton's like, I can, I agree, Sherlock. Um, <laughs> and Yang's Close. like, the fuck are you people talking about? <laughs> really uh, gross. Right. Uh, Holmes, uh, you know, the, the phone, it's never actually been analyzed uh, at all. No, not yet. We have not analyzed it. Very well. So, just wanted to put that out there. Of true, course, it's true. usually in zones where magic doesn't work and stuff like that, but I just thought I'd put that out there. Mm, that is a very, yes. We haven't because actually spent the time sure to I have a good examination phone. of said phone. Mm. So, uh, right. You guys head over to uh, uh, Burlington once Clums opens. And let's see, um, since uh, we'll have McKay do it, uh, give me the luck roll to have that fucking amazing timing where you guys show up and then, uh, you know, you get to watch everybody just, yeah. Honestly, everybody please. just leaves the police station and it's like, we have to go to the air end of town, says the sheriff deputy. <laughs> He's like, yes, sir. And off they go and the air, the air guys all go into the bank, the four guys. The four guys, you notice, uh, Corey, they all look like they're related. They all are carrying rifles and uh, pistols and stuff, and they just kind of march over into the bank as soon as the bank manager is opening the door. He greets them, open, holds open the door for them. They all go in. He goes in, and then, you know, uh, other bank employees show up, and they open up the bank and stuff. Not sure if you've actually been in the bank. I don't know. But I think so. Kind of almost robotic in the way the four people marched over type deal. And then the other guys, since he made that kind of luck roll, you just kind of stroll into the police station uh, because nobody's watching this area right now. It's just, it's one of those super movie slick moments. And um, who, who wants to try to chuck the uh, sword into the uh, bin? I'll the do it since... Wilder, I'm assuming. Yeah. Give me a willpower roll. Lower is better doesn't want to go in the bin. You mustn't put it in the bin. It tries to roll for something else. Nasha so man. He's like... Time three. Get in there, bitch! <laughs> uh, <laughs> right. He checks it in saying, get in there, bitch. It disappears into the bin. Uh, you thought you heard a uh, kind of a cutoff shriek, Chris, but it could just be your imagination. And you're pretty sure that now... That first general is definitely fucking dead. And if she ain't dead, she ain't happy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Then you pick up the phone. The phone's not even hooked to the wall. It's just a red phone. And you guys walk out. And it shows, like, just after you've gotten out and somebody else goes up to the police station for something else. It's like, where's my cat? You know, and you guys wander off. Wait, how big is the box that I tossed? Like, it's coffin-sized, right? No. It's not like we can cleanse it through, right? Uh, it's more like a large garbage can. Yeah, it's a big garbage can. Cleansing it through, it definitely be on the probably no, but um, if you can find a way to shadow walk out of here, which you can't, uh, then... Not enough takeoff room. Yeah. It, why why couldn't we shadow walk out of here? Pardon? Why couldn't we shadow walk out of here? Not big enough. You've got consider shadow walking like a runway, and your runway right now is eighty kilometers ish long, yeah. and there's no run hop in a car and drive from one end. Come on now. No, no, you no. Just, you need eighty eighty clock. Just because the you keep going over the same runway doesn't mean the runway is long enough. Okay, so we can't do the going in circles trick. No. No. Apparently, that was that was a uh, either a more advanced power or he's a bloody liar. Okay. Good to know, because I was considering yeah. that potentially in Burlington. You were considering to drive away. everything. What about oh, the yeah. gate? The gate up in the air? Through the water? Are you talking about the giant whirlpool? Yeah. Do you want to go it's look it's, at that with these guys? It's down. Yeah, go there, down. There is oh, a I, gate I, in the it goes temple. Into MMO down. Oh, there's a, well, then we have to deal with the Morlocks, don't we? Yeah, but they... Yeah, but if we put, if we put the if we go and get the keys to the to the car off the cooks, is it the cooks? 
Is that their name? Cooks. We can just uh, drive down there, can't we? Yeah, 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 exactly. No. It will be challenging because there are big giant chunks missing. Oh, uh, that's right. You guys used um yeah. grenades. Well, at least the, uh, entry, the entryway. And a, and there might be a car jammed in there already. Oh. If it didn't reset. <laughs> I see. Yeah. Well, that was the agent's car, not oh. ours. They they drove down there. Oh, really? Yeah. Interesting. We haven't actually tried to take an agent's car. Yeah, they actually jumped the hole that I made with a grenade and then drove down into the temple and then That's crashed the car. Because we do have a agent's mode of transport from another place. And there's apparently, they're supposed to be quite interesting. So having an agent's car might Wait a minute. Be I wonder if an agent's car can fly in other zones too. Like, yeah, that's why I was wondering if it tra if it if it transmogrifies itself to suit the land it's in. Because all the other agents shit did that. They had exactly. wands in and a flying carpet in MMO land. That so would be the get... ultimate shadow walking vehicle if that's what exactly, it does. Exactly, exactly right. Pete, I'd like to give you some cards, but you're not logged into roll twenty for a reason. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it's showing me at the thing. Yep. Yeah. We can go look. There we go. Yeah. You guys want to head over to the old Morlock Temple and see what's shaking there? Yep. You guys head over there. No Morlock Temple. Also, you remember how before you're losing Sandy due to space time because it looked all funky? That's not there either. It looks like it used to where you'd have to actually walk through and come out the other side of town before losing Sanity. Mm -hmm. mm. So it's it completely appears. gone now. Oh, yeah. Not even a hole left. Okay, so the agents have had it cleaned up then, which we've, which they've done previously for other stuff that's been lying around. They've got the town folks to clean it up. Consistency! But you've got two. the phone. Not one, but two play immediately. Perfect. Um, you... Rotter. All right. First one, well, first one is because they both got to get played. Is uh oh, five hero are added to an NPC of the GM's choice. I know which one. Yes, yes, yes. And then the next one is killing is wrong. If you have any points toward cold blooded killing, discard all cards immediately. Nice. And there goes all my rerolls. That's better. So, <laughs> uh, that's a rough one. Well, I right. actually should be, I'm pretty sure I have points to cold blooded killing. I'm pretty sure, I'm so. sure Mildred's caused me to have points towards cold blooded killing. You shouldn't have slapped her around like that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, that started a whole plot line it, right there. Just did. That, yes, that little yes, line of do. bullshit. All I right. So, who's carrying the phone? I'll carry it. I was. Oh, oh you, you got carry it? Him? Okay. No, 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 no. I was going to suggest we get it. something and we lash the receiver onto it so it doesn't accidentally fall off. And Right. And then the uh, agents. Done. Done. You guys pick up some string and shit and lash yeah, it together. Yeah. Great. Yeah, string, masking tape. Um, yeah. Yeah. You, I, I don't know if you guys know what the magic working in this zone is or not so what next i can't oh we, we every so often we do magic stuff in this zone but we're certainly not going to do it in the middle of the street very difficult here uh, yeah. alex uh was cursing it up and down yeah I, I yeah i think it's gotten harder here i recall this when we we're trying to check out the clock yeah hmm. so where to well, this gate's gone, so I don't know. The only other gate is with the Shoggoth, as far as I know. Yeah, no, no, the Shoggoth's not though. there. And Clems. Yeah, so we can go and see if the um, the Naughty Leprechaun, the Naughty Shamrock, or the other airship that they've got is there. Hmm. That, that's a good use, point. If you wanted to use the um, Whirlpool and take the black box out of here that way. You head over to the big screen that's up, 
and you get there and it looks like it's kind of abandoned and nobody's been there in a while. It's a mysterious reason as to why not. I know they said that they've been having trouble using the gate. Like they don't want, like they can't open it and close it. Like, I don't, I don't know. It, it mystified me because if it's always open, they should be able to just go back and forth. No, no, they want to be able to close it. Right, but if it's, it's not closed, it's open, so I don't understand why they're not still doing their... Maybe Correct. they've worked out a way of closing it. Maybe the Shoggoth, the other Shoggoth decided to go there. Uh, Corey, Let's do you have uh, space time the... distortions maxed out? I'm guessing the R2 already. Yes, though. yes, I do. You guys look at the giant like whirlpool and like the other the storm like that starts right on along a line. You're like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that gets fixed out real quick. <clears throat> mm -hmm. yeah, I love so, it. so it's still there. Oh yeah, yeah. The whirlpool's sucking down water like it always does. Okay. It appears completely unchanged. So yes, it appears Doc Fulton may be onto something. What mysterious thing is keeping them from using the airship now? Or even the, the clubs? You don't see any Burlington guys around here right now. No. But then they wouldn't come over if there wasn't an airship to load stuff up on anyway. Because it's Well, and you can take very small loads and shit. In yeah, lap, true, but... true, like a backpack or something. Yeah. Um, so if we go down there. Or a sex spot. Out the, oh no 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 that's right the the mountains in land of the lost come out next come out into either canada or into the mines that go into canada through a very tight um crevice i think that's where it actually comes out i'm just trying to remember what glenn and dana told me i love how all these areas are just fucking riddled with gates the yeah the um it. it's one one of the ones that you've got to crawl over or walk over that's got the chasm below. I think the chasm below is what goes into um, Land of the Lost. I think that's where it is. And I think it goes in... I think it is in the southern slash northern mountains. Even in Burlington, when the sky is normally always... Uh perfect blue and stuff it appears to be overcast here which is weird because burlington is never overcast it's the storm watch brews that's probably not good right it's more more of the effects of the um whole zog stuff <laughs> What to do? What to do? You're watching the sun slowly crawl across the sky. Can, can we not use clams to go to the lost? Or? Yeah, yeah, we're just more just trying to work out if we could take the um, black box. Oh, right. Which you'd have to go back to the police station to get and hope not to be spotted. Yes. Did we want to go to... What do you want the black box for, anyway? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, we I, I it, it'd be just a good way to get rid of shit. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, that's Doc all. Was I know MMO it. Land wanted ways to get rid of things, like, like they came across, and I know that we had a couple mm -hmm. evil things that we wanted to, quote-unquote, get rid of. Mm -hmm. Well, you we definitely got rid of one just a second ago. Uh-huh. It feels like your brain has uh, gotten rid of a lot of the gunk, which you didn't even realize was settling in there. Mm. Good. Mm. Oh, of course, using the Mygo hair pick might have gotten rid of some of that. Mm. Oh, it's so good. Stroke the brain. Well. You guys are standing on the street. People wander by wishing you happy Friday. Oh. I still think we should open up a Fridays here. We clean up. TGIF. Yep. Hell yeah. Mud slides <laughs> are for everybody. <laughs> it might be really popular. Of course, the problem is that you haven't seen like 
only you've only seen one piece of money that's not even here anymore. So other than that, mm -hmm. the dime that sits on the pinball machine. Quarter, quarter, sir. Quarter, sorry. That's in the pinball machine. Correct. Well, there's always the gate that's in the office, or is that just a one way? The which one way? There's a gate in the office. Yeah, it points oh, to an office block. Um, one that, that was a one the way. Or, oh, is that where it goes to the asylum? I, I right, think I the mean, asylum the spits out into the office. Yeah, ah, yeah, yeah. Right. That, that's you're it. Right. We got to have the asylum into the office. Well, don't you have reorientate gate? Like, can't you? <laughs> <laughs> you know, just shift that shit, go wherever you want. Yeah, I've got to be, I've got to know the place really well to be able to go to it. Otherwise, I'd be able to relocate the gate in Land of Lost, but I can't because I don't know Land of Lost well enough. I have not become acclimatized to it as yet. I don't uh, think you want to spend a month there. No. So, yes, becoming acclimatized, I need to be acclimatized to a place to be able to change, to be able to have a gate go to it. Well, let's just go to Clem's then. Go that way. Yeah. Yes. Give up on your your hijacking a piece of loot. You don't even know what you want it for. You just want it because it's loot. So. No, we want it. It's loot. Now, I I just remembered that the, we needed a, we wanted it for some other reasons or to permanently get rid of some things, but I don't I don't recall why exactly or what it was with someone else. Mm. There's the, there's the occasional items we think. Now, if I, now we really, we've used it several times for permanent disposal. Yeah, we, I know we put some bodies in there too. Mm -hmm. All right, let's well, use Clem to go is. to MMO land first. No problem. You guys all, all head over to Clem's, and after the usual song and dance, you appear in MMO land. And one of the guards, uh, there's a lot of like uh, heavy medieval weaponry pointed at you guys. Goes, McKay, thank God you're here. And Fulton and their friend, please come with me. Okay. All right. He takes you over uh, quickly uh, over to uh, Darius's uh, uh, and Claire's place. And. And a reminder, Logan, that all the background people feel about me as they feel. Oh, yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. He, 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 it just shows him, like, some kid comes and latches onto his leg, and he's doing the fucking awkward walk, and the kid's like, I love this leg so much! And he's like, God damn it. Popular guy. Oh, yeah. I'm sure Corey's had that happen to him before. He's a dad. Where oh, sure. latch on and won't fucking let go, and then you gotta yeah. get, like, a giant shoehorn or something. Let go where it gets the belt. <laughs> Don't threaten me with a good time. <laughs> promises. No problem. Uh, you go in there, and Darius has a couple of things. He's like, ah, thank goodness you guys are here. All right. First, we've been getting some blowback about possibly closing the gate because a lot of water, and we think fish, come down through that thing. So we're worried if we close it, then, you know, well, because the, the Mar River is already flowing, but it's a lot slower and stuff on the air side of the gate. Mm -hmm. And then it gets much faster on this side. So people are worried about that. So don't close it yet unless you find out if there's a way to keep the water going, right? Okay. Uh, right. The other thing is uh, the airship, uh, the, the naughty leprechaun is currently busted. We, unfortunately, to build it, we had to use all the wood that we could find. So um, we we had uh, some people from Alexburg show up requesting aid. They got a nice farming community. They also needed wood. Uh, and they, they found that going up the Bleak River for about a week, they found a huge forest, plenty of wood. Wood that we could possibly use, I'm not sure, to repair the airship. But there's something wrong with the forest. People the tree are, ants didn't like you cutting into them? I don't know what a tree ant is, but people, when they're complained about nightmares, are feeling uneasy. We need you guys to go into the forest and fix it. Okay. They're planning on making a, uh, uh, once, once you guys fix it, they're planning on making a uh, uh, logging camp called McKayburg. Okay. Yeah. So... Also, we've been having some other issues. 
have the um, mm -hmm. magic users that have gone looking for the source of magic come back yet? Not yet. We're, we're hoping to get the airship repaired and then look for them. What's wrong with the airship exactly? Well, we had some problems. Uh, one of the times we went through, he looks around and he goes, Mr. Pickles uh, had a little issue when going through one of the times. And so the airship got pretty bashed up. But I, he's normally a very good pilot. The accidents happen. We understand. It didn't kill anybody or anything like that, but it's definitely in need of some repairs. In addition to that, uh, we've discovered that uh, Corden Lamsley, the ambassador over at the Forge Hand clan, mm. he has the makings of a good spy in him. He's requested some additional uh, people to go down there and work as uh, his, uh, oh, what's that cook's assistant called? Sous chef, I think he called it. So he's mm. like some sous chefs. We're going to send those once we can get the airship fixed. Uh, we're going to send people who know something about espionage and stuff to keep an eye on things. Keep an eye on our allies and such. And what about your second airship? That one uh, has gone off looking for the mages. Okay. Yes. We, we plan on launching an expedition to find the airship at a later time. Um, in addition to that, we've been approached by... Uh, uh, another dwarven clan who wants us to sell them spices. So we're hoping you guys can get another metric ton of spices for them. That's the Snow Shield clan. Gotcha. But also the Snow Shield clan has, uh, uh, they said that they can't give us weapons and armor. All that they have available is gold and gems. I, uh, PC. Yes, I, I, I know that you guys very much like some gold and gems, mm. but um, we we just don't have the spices and such for them uh but they they're happy to pay and pay well for spices nice unfortunately the snow shield clan also has uh an issue that they're requesting our aid with uh the, there's some powerful group of ogres that's moved into an old dwarvish area that's above their living areas uh they would like them taken care of uh, they would do it themselves, but there's some sort of forbidden evil thing up there, according to the elders, and it's forbidden for the dwarves to go back up to the old area that they used to hold. Apparently, it's some sort of pass, and I find this interesting because I don't know where the pass goes to. It's passed through the mountains. Hmm. Can you help with any of that things? He says, loading more shit onto you. More shit! Unfortunately, we're in the middle of dealing with the um, zone-destroying army and their generals. Ah, he says. Hey, Logan. Be hoping to stop them before they make it here to MMA land. You know, the Zogs, you know, Zogs guys. Oh, that, that, um, yeah, you're familiar with that. Well, put a pin in, put a pin in these things. Uh, as soon as you're done with that, we'd very much like some help with some of this. Or if you have anybody who's not dealing with that problem, could you please send them to me to deal with these other things? Uh, some of your perhaps uh, less skilled colleagues or something who aren't dealing with the big picture of death. Hmm. I know a couple people that might be good for that later. Excellent. I'll, if you I'll can... recommend it to them. Thank you so much. Yes, we can definitely use uh, people for these things. You said Logan, Chris? Uh, yeah, uh, I'll be playing tomorrow. Really? Yep. I will add you to the list. Add you to the list. I'm so sorry to hear your plans got fucked. Not yeah. sorry, not sorry. <laughs> yeah, I got proper fucked, too. That's not good. What, what, you what were your plans? Did you have good plans? Yeah, I did, actually. Mm -hmm. yeah. A lot of sex was in his future, but now he gets to hang out with Logan instead. Yay. Even better. Even better. So Chris is up for Saturday. Sex, Logan. <laughs> there is no Logan. <laughs> yes, yes. Logan? Hey, yeah, Logan, some, grab them video, bars. Video. It's time for that cell block D loving. <laughs> some Sex you want, you Logan. don't get. <laughs> <laughs> Sex you get, you don't want.
Um, I just see somebody who doesn't know it, and this is their first episode. They're listening to them. Uh, uh, okay, so for, just as a reminder, tomorrow then is Pete, Alex, Chris, and then Matt, Yana, Alex on the next day. So Alex will be the great bearer of information to the next group. Alex Kinley, we got a job for you. <laughs> <laughs> that actually, this stuff would be good jobs for Alex Kinley. Yeah, uh, just no, no, no. We just say we, we've dealt with the generals. Now go and deal with Zog. Oh man, that's harsh. <laughs> well, assuming you get to the generals, I'm not making. Well, that it's either that or we wait. I think Chris and I are with Matt next week or the week after. Uh, yeah, you're with Matt on uh, Saturday at twenty third. Uh, by the way, Corey, uh, Friday the 21st still got a spot open. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's take a look real quick. Uh, no. I, Chris is playing that day. I know you don't like him at all, but still he is. I love my I'm buddy. Bastard. <laughs> I love my Pooh Bear. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, yeah, uh, I still have the box, too. Aww. Oh, yeah. I made sure he got that box back when I found it over my place that I was at. Um, yeah, uh, check out Friday the 21st and Friday the 28th, Corey, because that's uh, pretty much, uh, yeah, and then the Friday after it. So Friday, Friday, and Friday are open, and then after okay. that, it gets weird. Or send it, wait, your kid goes to school on Friday for some reason. Yeah. yeah. Weird. Weird. That whole education thing. What the fuck? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. School is not a place for smart people. The government gets all upset and shit when you don't send them to school. It's like crazy. Yeah. Well, uh, hopefully, uh, if she gets into this enough during the summer, might be uh, her her uh, immersive time. Who knows? Mm -hmm. I don't know what's in the mind of a fucking 15-year-old kid, especially a 15-year-old girl. Mystery then, mystery now, not solved. Right. So let's go kick some dinosaurs. I have no um, idea what the player's going to do. If you want to quickly go through the cards and check the phone out. I still think that we should just use the phone when we get, like, like I, I think that we're right. I think if we use the phone in Dino Land or Land of the Lost, that's like, they will be our distraction as we go in and try to yeah, get yeah, to yeah, the yeah. general. But we might as well examine it here while we're in an area where we can examine magic shit to see what we can work out about it without using That's, it. Yeah, I, I get that. That's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I didn't mean I, not to take it with us. I just meant we've got an opportunity now oh, to sure, check sure. her out. Uh, since we're here, I will pop a charge and give it a look. Great. Give me an analyze magic at full. Yes, yeah, so I was going to do this. And then give me a uh, uh, willpower roll not to uh, possibly wet yourself. Assuming you make the errors. Uh, analyze magic by negative 30. I think I'll wet myself anyway, just, you know, because it's fun. Hold on. <laughs> no problem. You fucking cut loose. I, I make my willpower times five. Well, since shit. I'm at it and it's a new day, let's see if I can Ooh. pop this shit too. Hold on. I'm going to play a I skill made my 15. Analyze magic as well. Those of you who made your analyze magic. Uh, the phone has a quasi magic on it, if that makes sense. You think it probably yeah. works in uh -huh. tech areas as well? Detect right. power pattern. Hmm. Nice. Uh, the phone has a wee bit, but it's a very wee bit. It's kind of like the uh, AAA battery of it. But is there anywhere has, else around that I can see that's in this area that may have or not within not within your ten meter radius? Okay. So we, what do we look like when you do that? Uh, that yeah, you, you two have been touched by pattern, but it, it, it's more for objects than people. Sure. You know, Show me where uh, the pattern touched you. Yes, exactly. The alarming thing about the phone, though, is it def definitely has a tracker in it, which is active and possibly calling the agents right now, and you realize that you should probably be hurrying to wherever you're going because... They may show up since it's been moved. You're not sure. <laughs> Sorry, I, I just had this that. image of us turning up to the compound. Compound. Candy Graham. Candy Graham from Mongo. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. What? There you go. Bye bye. 
and heading over the phone and then buggering off. To Zog with love. Happy Valentine's Day. Yes. <laughs> so it was, was that yesterday, today, somewhere in the world, wasn't it? What do you guys do? So is that the only thing that's on there, the, the, the tracker thing? Uh, yeah. Okay. So it's Which slightly magic, will work in most locations. It's, it's techie magic, so it, it works in both. You're thinking you'd definitely call somebody wherever. Got one's out, Matt. Can definitely reach out and touch someone then, for sure, with uh -huh. this. Exactly. I would try it, Matt, but, you know, the cat's been really weird lately. Oh, you little shit bag. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, that's what Logan calls it, too. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, it goes out for fucking Matt. I hate that cat so much. So, right, it's you guys... It's an animal. You, you, of course you hate it. You yes. Know, like, Logan and animals. Animals. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, you guys hurry over to Clem's, and he goes, Howdy, what can I do you for? And then he kind of, like, he goes over and looks out the window, which he's never done before, and he comes back. He goes, Howdy, what can I do you for? Uh -oh, I look out the, the window now, too. You guys see, it looks like a flying carpet with a uh, design of a, a the, with pyramid. The triangle. With a, triangle. A pyramid. Yeah. Yes. So uh, post-apocalyptic, because that's where the head is. Or all right. Bug, Bug City. Bug City. All right. Hot towel? Yes, yes please. please. No problem. You guys uh, get all that. You're in Bug City, and you guys uh, uh, hurry over to. Uh, Need uh, cards. I've never been here. Ah, well done. Hold on a second. Your cards are a new card. Oh no, wait. Uh, order. There we go. Temperance and the Two of Cups. Right uh, now, a last last that I knew you'd left your flying car in front of Clams, Chris. Yeah. Hey, uh, luck rolled a quarter to see if it's still there or if somebody has taken off with it or something because you just kind of parked it on the street like it'll be there when we get back. Park the car in the bay. Best parking ever. Got it. <laughs> James. Uh, it says you roll a, a luck roll at full. Right. Oh, I want it by negative. Then I didn't make it. No problem. It's gone. Okay. You become alarmed. No, that's easy. Then we just go to... Uh, so the Clemson in Night City doesn't work, is what you're saying. No, we could potentially... Depending on the nature. The... The barber pole is in the safe in currently in the safe in embassy. Mo, in embassy because um freddy took it from there okay um but whether or not we can appear there because we've appeared we've used clems to travel to a location where clems has been broken we just haven't can't leave it by that by clems I mean, we could try traveling to night city using clems and see what it happens. was very difficult to leave night city uh, last time I was there, <laughs> it almost killed Freddy. I think repeatedly. All right, so what we could do is we could go to Gotham, steal a car. Yes. Drive. Drive through Shadow, get a flying car from Night City. While we're doing that, we could see what's going on in Night City now that you know mm -hmm. we did the attack there. Mm -hmm. And then. Because I'm pretty sure that things are going to be pretty fucked there. So, like, and what, it's sorry. probably a war zone at this point. So, so your thinking is we get a get a flying vehicle, get a flying car, and then drop bombs from the flying car, and hopefully don't get shot out of the sky. Or no, because I don't think a flying car will work in uh, Land of the Lost. So, so what do you we take want? Take the flying car. We shadow walk then to uh, Alien Takeover. Fly to where we. Ah. Put the head, hop yeah, in the yeah, head, yeah. and then. Uh, yeah, sorry. As a, as a quick side note, the alien head is uh, as likely to work as a flying car. There, they're both tech. 
Oh, so I could just use a. So it, it would be. But the flying car would probably do a better job if you can find one. Just yeah. because, I mean, it, it you wouldn't have the cool gun down the nose the way you did before, but. Yeah, but no one knows heavy laser rifle. I don't know why you people don't buy these skills and shit. Was there, I mean, there's a, there, there is a turret on the. I'm not fucking on, Buck Rogers. I, I know, I, I know. Good character concept, though. I imagine if somebody came in with that. I'm Buck Rogers type guy. <laughs> if Yang dies, then I will be future Merc. <laughs> All right. Um, how did you want to die? <laughs> I don't think you. I know the garbage can right. you could crawl into. <laughs> <laughs> we, we know just the way to permanently kill you. God damn. Okay. Oh, speak, speaking of which, Mildred has asked that if she completely loses it, we take her somewhere where she can perm where we can permanently kill her. Okay. That's easy for you guys. So. Yep. Yep. What do you do? You're hanging out in the club, just waiting for. Death. So well, we gotta go, right? Because it's the agents are gonna call, cross over mm -hmm. here. Mm -hmm. so like, how long going? was it before the agents showed up in MMO? Guessing. Uh, give me a memory of full. Memory of full. You weren't really paying attention at the time. We could bounce over to Dino right. Land and just do a run in. Thirty-seven oh. minutes. Oh, okay. You know, run over there, throw it into the doorstep, and then bounce. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, but see, we're going to use them for the distraction because they're going to attack, and then they're going to attack, and they're going to attack, and it's going to become fucking crazy chaos there. Which is when oh, yeah. we strike. You know, we infiltrate to get to uh, mm -hmm. the general. All right. So, do we do we go to Gotham get a vehicle, or do we try and get to straight to Night City? See, the only problem though is if we go if we go straight to Night City, we might be entering into a war zone. Yeah, and we could be far away, away from anywhere where we can get a vehicle. Because because where Clems was was right in the middle of Night City, which is right in the middle of. Uh, where all the Cybermen were being made, correct? All right. So, Gotham, get a vehicle, shutter walk? Yeah. All right, I have a it. truck. The spice truck. I can drive it. Uh, actually, yeah, I did forget about that. It is parked in front of the Clems in Burlington. Burlington. Oh, we can't shadow walk out of Burlington. Well, sorry, guys. But it, it, it's a very unique you... thing. Okay, so you got it to Burlington. And then what you then covered carried the spices from Burlington across to MMO land. Yeah, that was uh, Freddie's idea. I okay. actually Not got a bad the... one because it, because it means that the truck you because you you got a controlled area where you're going to appear when you shadow walk. Which... Yeah, I have uh, a uniform for the spice factory. <laughs> <laughs> yes, <Yeah. he> does. <laughs> perfect. All right. perfect disguise. Oh yeah. Shall we do? Right. Shall, all right. So let's go to Gotham. Okay. okay. We clems over to Gotham. Right. It looks like it's nighttime. The cold rain drizzles down from the sky like tears from God. Gargoyle. I pull my putter just to, so he can have a little bit of ambiance here, too. You pull your putter. It seems to absorb the light, making the whole city a little dimmer. <laughs> I, I stroke my putter. <laughs> no problem. You can almost hear a gentle sighing. I figured you'd like that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the ghost of Batman's in the putter. Sure. Okay. <laughs> and the whole reason that this city is raining and dark is because the shadow of Batman hole. And why well, it's called Gotham, it didn't used to be called Gotham, it was San Angeles, is the shade of Batman envelops the city. Batman attempts something while he's out and being stroked. 
No. <sighs> I, you can do it. I believe in you. Sticky. You have a supporter reroll for him? No. Yeah. I did. Mm. I lost it. <laughs> All right, let's go. Okay. Right, you guys no, 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 go. No, no. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Uh, I'm gonna need a mechanical repair and electronic repair, and you've hotwired. You've gotten into the car and hotwired. If uh, mechanical repair, if you have lock picking instead, you can do that. Otherwise, you, if you fail your mechanical repair, you can break a fucking window instead. All right, hold on. You find a car in the alley. There's a lot of alleys here. <laughs> whole lot of alleys. They're all dark. Hmm. Yeah. I don't lock pick it. A couple of hobos are having sex that. nearby. Uh, there you go. I got my repair, my mechanical yeah, repair by half. Yeah, it didn't help you. Hey, you're into the car? Give me an electronic repair for a hot wire. There we go, by half. Vroom, look at it. No problem. Uh, Chris, give me a luck roll for style of the car. How stylish is this car? By half. <laughs> no problem. It's it's like a, a kind of looks a little bit like the agent's car. It's like a Lincoln Town Car type of deal. Do, do, nice. do, 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 do. In fact, there's even uh, several pair of uh, dark shades on the dashboard. I put them on instantly. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> no you, you guys are all wearing we dark have a shades. Take gas. gas. You do. And away you go. Is there a pack of cigarettes cigarette. in the glove box? <laughs> yes. <laughs> you guys cruise off. Uh, no problem with that kind of luck. Yeah. It's pretty the only much thing that stands in our way are Illinois Nazis. <laughs> Goddamn Nazis. <laughs> Welcome to 2019. And anyway. <laughs> Somebody listen to this in the future will go, hmm? Um, no problem. You guys cruise off. Uh, who's going to be doing the shadow walking? And wait, before shadow walking, I want to know, A, who's attempting it? B, set destination. So we're going to go tonight sitting in a flying car. So yep. uh, that's our destination. I know at least two of you know it well enough to shadow walk. Uh, only two of you can shadow walk. So, yeah, that works. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be awkward if Corey was the only one who knew it really well, and the two people who could shadow walk were like, never been there. Can't go. Night what? <laughs> <All right. laughs> go, go, Chris. Corey, you've already been to Night City, yeah? Nope. Yes. I think it's your right. turn to... My turn. Uh, oops, wrong. Where's me shadow walking? You're going to blow a whole day if you don't manage to pull this off. Yeah. I think I just said, I think I had a skill play skill plus five huh. just because I've got it. Huh. Travel. Five. It appears the hey. Illinois Nazis are thwarting both of you. I have a reroll if anybody wants it. Ooh, there you go. See if that'll spend a day here. I'm we don't have a day. The agents. We have to put, then we'd have to go to Clems, go to no. Burlington. <laughs> And if the phone is in Burlington, the agents won't come after us, and we right. can wait in Burlington for a night right. and then come back again. Maybe, maybe. Um, uh, but yeah, well, we can go uh, to Burlington, put it back in the um, police station, and then go rest, and go go next day, collect it, and do it all over. Well, keep in mind that was an amazing luck roll because yes. a lot of times some some citizen might see you, and then all kind of shit, as you've seen before, starts. Well, actually. So the reroll might be a good thing. As no, no, no. Uh, well, actually, there's. I've got another way we can travel. I'll try that <gasps> first. You're not going to blow then... yourselves up, are you? Tour grenade. Let's see where it goes. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm going to try doing the yes. <laughs> wow, no problem. You guys take like a week or two to fucking get there, but uh, you're always moving and shit. Unfortunately. The slower rate of travel will uh, necessitate a driving roll from uh, Chris, who is driving. As part of the time, you think that there's a car. It's way the fuck back there, but it's definitely fucking trying to chase your ass. Unfortunately for them, you're really fucking good at driving. So you manage to elude them, and eventually you guys get to, uh, where were you heading to? Cyberpunk. That's right. Um, 
so let's see, McKay, since you're the one who did the Royal Road, well thought there, well thought out, by the way, uh, go ahead and give me a luck roll, lower is better. This is trying for the luck that Doc Fulton had when he went to the place, because obviously you could be literally anywhere in the world right now, possibly in Taiwan. That's all right, as long as there's flying cars in Taiwan, I don't care where we uh, are. Oh, yeah, the Royal Road, I'm giving you a kicker for that, so I'm going for basically half instead of a quarter like I did with uh, Fulton before. Uh, quarter. Uh, right. Right. Uh, there's there's a uh, flying car up ahead. Its doors are open, uh, and it looks like the people from the flying car. Pardon? Somebody left the keys in there. Yes, they did, and they're, they're chasing other people down the streets, yelling about their dog or some shit. And you guys park the car, leave the car, leave the keys in the ignition, and hop in their flying car. <laughs> leave the doors open. All right, what are you Someone two doing? Make sure the uh, I'm following. Phone is with. Yeah. Now, I would like to point out, last time Chris tried this, the other guy did not know he was supposed to follow, and that was fucking hilarious. <laughs> he and then he drove off in the fucking car. <laughs> Alex is not a criminal. That's all I got to say. He has no criminal tendencies and didn't get it. It was fucking fantastic. So that says good things about his character. Anyway, you guys all instantly Bad get out. Him, not his car. character, because his character is supposedly a criminal. Yeah, well, I'm not a real life character. But <laughs> I yes. know what you mean. Yeah. I know what you mean. His, yeah, his character is probably just a cyber criminal. He has no yeah. other tendencies. But fraud, that kind of thing. Uh, so you guys get out, take off. Uh, give me a fly car roll, please, there, Chris. Says you are the driver all the fucking time because you know how to fly cars. And I want you to crash into a building. I have. God damn it. You guys are like discovering the joys of the fucking five-pointed so, harness. Where are, where are we? Uh, you're not even sure, honestly. I'll check the nerve system. All right, sure. Give me a computer use roll. Please fumble it. Just turn off the goddamn yeah, car yeah, while yeah, you yeah. try to fly it. That will make me so I'm, happy. I, somebody has done that in a flying car. I can't remember who, but I do remember mm -hmm. that happening. Yeah, I'll make my computer use roll. Uh, you are in Wisconsin. Okay. Turn the radio on, listen to the, see if we can get the news or if there's news on the screen. Try and Welcome to Cheeseheads International. We are here at the world's largest cheese wheel where we are eating up cheese curds dipped in gravy. And, oh, no, it looks like one of the judges just had another heart attack. Well, though, probably the EMTs are standing by. They're administering the shots. One. Two. He's up again. He's up. All right. And he's waving to the crowd as he gets Put back in the, the table. Looks like he's ready to judge this contest here at Wisconsin Dells. All righty. So no no national news or anything. Mm. Now they haven't even reported your car stealing yet. Yeah, yeah, I don't care about that. I was more interested. Any news about what's happening in San Angeles? Cut to. It shows the other two guys come back from chasing the guy and his dog. And they're looking on the street. And one goes, dude, where's your car? He's like. Dude, where's my car? Dude, where's your car? And this goes on for quite some time. Meanwhile, uh, who's doing the shadow walkie walkie? Uh, I will do it this time. Yeah, give it a shot. Uh, set destination, please. Uh, no, 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 no. We're, the, yeah. No? no, 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 no. Like, yeah, Dino. See, I keep calling it Dino Land, and you guys keep yeah, calling Dino it Land. Is, Dino Land, Land is also what it's, Dino Land is also what it's called. Oh, okay. It is actually, yeah, so you're fine calling it Dino Land because it is called that as well. 